Welcome to Link 2023. Uh, I am Professor Laurent Pierrot from Reims, France. And I am with Professor Christophe Cognat from Toulouse, France. Chris, uh, you were presenting a clever study during the Microvention Symposium with a very interesting result. Can you summarize briefly a clever study? Yes, before summarizing, I would like to uh, uh, remind you that this is a seventh study concerning the web device. And this is something which is extremely important. It's probably the best, the device which has been the best evaluated since it was launched on the market. So now we have, uh, we have had studies for the first web, the double layer, then for the single layer, then the enhanced visualization. Every new generation of the web, there, there, there was an, a new study. And this is something which is really remarkable. And there are some uh, devices which are put on the market with no evaluation at all. And this is, for me, very uh, regrettable. So this new study from uh, Microvention about the web concerns only the web 17, so with a, a lower catheter, a lower profile catheter of 17 uh, inch. And then it finally, uh, you can use web of three to seven millimeter in diameter, entering into the 17 uh, catheter. Uh, in this clever study, there were uh, ruptured and unruptured aneurysm. 60 uh, ruptured, 100 unruptured, and what I was presenting in that link, uh, 2023, uh, are, are the result at one year of the safety and the efficacy. Very interesting design, singularly because you have both uh, ruptured and unruptured aneurysm. So, what are the results in terms of safety in clever? in both groups and is singularly for Reptorid is showing the same result at Sclaris, which is the benefit of web in terms of prevention of web bleeding. So the results are even uh, much better. Every time there is a new study on the web and you look at the result, you are, you're saying, my God, it's not possible that the morbid mortality is so low, but yes, yeah, so low, but yes, it's true. Uh, so it was true for the, for the web IT studies, the uh, US one, the Chinese study as well. And for Cle uh, Clever, so Web17, it is the same. So the, uh, there were only three strokes, finally minor strokes, among 163 patients. Uh, and there was no mortality at all. So finally the morbidity is around 2% and there is no mortality at all in both ruptured and unruptured aneurysm. And for me, the very important point is that because of this uh, low profile, uh, the indication has changed. So it was before mainly the large neck uh, bifurcation aneurysm, so MCA, uh, ACA, carotid T, basilar T. And since we have this low profile uh, catheter, now we address as well Uh, the pica aneurysm, the picom aneurysm, the pericalosal aneurysm. So there is a wide range of locations in which today people don't hesitate to use the, the web because the web 17 is much easier to place. And despite the angle, for example, when you have a picom, there is an acute angle for, uh, of the aneurysm compared to the direction of the artery. And with the new system, it's not a problem. So there is a major enlargement of the indication of the web by the location we can treat. And the other point is as well that people don't hesitate to treat any more uh, ruptured aneurysm. And it's interesting because with the Web17 you treat small aneurysm from b below, below 2 mm to 7 mm. Uh, and finally, uh, first the results are very good in terms of morbid mortality. It's similar to the one of un unruptured aneurysm. Protection against free bleed is perfect. And people who are treating in, in clever, very, very small aneurysm up to 1.5 or 2 millimeter in diameter. So because of this low profile, people don't hesitate to treat very, very small uh, ruptured aneurysm with the web. And what are the results in terms of uh, efficacy? Uh, efficacy is uh, similar in both groups, ruptured and ruptured? So the or? efficacy is similar in both groups. It's uh, higher in ruptured aneurysm. For, indeed, it's not uh, st statistically significant, uh, but it's higher in the uh, ruptured group. It's 82% complete. 
uh, occlusion, which is very high. Uh, and the results are better than in uh, Clary's study, which was uh, dedicated to ruptured aneurysm, whatever their size was. So the, the results in terms of efficacy are, are, are really good in those small uh, ruptured or unruptured aneurysms. So thank you very much uh, for presenting uh, the study and uh, the very good results in terms of uh, safety and efficacy and singularly for showing the enlargement of indication to ruptured aneurysm and also to other location, for example, uh, PICOM, as you have said, or peri uh, uh, PERICA or uh, pericalosal aneurysm. So thank you very much. Thank you very much, Laurent.